<clears throat> Hello everyone, I'm Trekker Tech and as you saw in my What's in my bag video for this 2023 and if you haven't seen it just please click up here but in that video I mentioned my Chromebook and how much I like my Chromebook. Um, when Asa got in touch with me to have a look at the latest Chromebook Spin 514 all-in-one touchscreen device, I was thrilled. So this is the Chromebook Spin 514 with an Intel 11 Gen Core i3 1110G4 with iRes XE graphics, 8GB of DDR4 RAM, 128GB NVMe SSD storage, Wi-Fi 6, not 6E, Bluetooth 5.0 and a Hue 4670 milliamps hour battery for a wholesome 10 hours of use with 65 watts charging via USB-C. Now externally, we got one USB type A 3.2 Gen 1 and a USB type C on the right hand side. And on the left hand side, we got a power button, microphone headphone combo, a full HDMI and another USB type C. Now, this laptop has been my best friend for the past week. It's ideal for multitasking, writing down scripts, sending emails, and Zoom meetings with that crispy 1080p webcam located on the top of this beautiful 14 inch full HD 1080p multi touch screen with a 62.8% sRGB coverage and an average Delta E color variance of. 2.07, making this laptop good enough for any design work, but I cannot really imagine anyone buying a Chromebook with creativity in mind. And I see this laptop more as a tablet with a keyboard at the back. And I think this is the best feature of this laptop because you can go from a fully laptop, just to write emails and scripts and whatnot, to a fully 14 inch tablet mode that you can watch on YouTube or, or scroll the web with this hinge design that let you turn it completely all the way around. And again, it's a Chromebook. It's not built for heavy machinery, but thanks to the i3 1110G4, it's more than capable to remote into any cloud service like Xbox Cloud or one doing right now here with Parsec. Cat jumps. And temperatures is not an issue whatsoever. I mean, this laptop got a state-of-the-art cooling design, a fanless cooling design, and it's more than capable to play cloud gaming like we're doing here. Let's go cat, let's go that way. There's no issues whatsoever. This is remote with Parsec from my main machine back then. But yeah, it's working beautifully. Question was today, would you switch your Windows or Mac laptop for a Chromebook as your daily driver? Let me know in the comments below, please. But if you're thinking about it, link will be in the video description down below to where to buy. Huge thanks to Acer UK for sending me this review unit. Thank you very much, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video and if you're looking for any suggestion, check out more videos over here, top and bottom. Don't forget to subscribe and please, please, please like this video because we need to crack that YouTube algorithm. So thanks for watching guys, I'm Tech and we'll see you on the next one. Adios.